Hi, everybody. My name's Drew. I met my wife-to-be eight years ago while teaching English in South Korea. Since then, we've been pretty much inseparable. Today, I'm going to try to surprise her with a special proposal she'll never forget. After all, you only get one shot at this. Hi, John. How are you? It's Andrew. Oh, hi, Andrew. Hi, how's it going? Uh, going good. Good, good. Are you, you're in Asoyas, are you? I'm in Asoyas, yeah. It's, uh, it's a sunny day. It's, uh, well, it's five degrees. My question for you, the reason I was calling, I, I'm going to su- uh-huh. surprise Anne with um, proposal, uh, proposing tomorrow. So right. I just was going to uh, kind of go old, kind of old school here just to check to make sure uh, it's okay by you. Okay, so maybe don't tell anybody yet, because I'm gonna I'm gonna try to do a video about it. So then uh, maybe I'll get Maida to watch it and Linda to watch it, and they can kind of have a surprise too. Okay. All right. Th- All right. Thanks, John. Okay. Bye-bye. Okay, bye bye. Okay. I'm uh, out on another little excursion, uh, and still not feeling 100%. So I'm using that as an excuse so I can go and do a few jobs without her. Usually we go shopping and stuff together. The proposal is going to be part of a geocache because she loves geocaching. I uh, was sick for, I don't know, three weeks. I was in the hospital for three days and uh, Anne was just by my side the whole time and I kept telling her that as soon as I start feeling better, I'm going to make it up to her by doing a really, uh, really nice day for her. So tomorrow won't be too unusual because I've, I've scheduled the day, the, the nice day for her tomorrow and uh, she just doesn't know that there's gonna be the proposal in there. Carrying the camera around, she won't suspect anything because I do make so many videos, YouTube videos. I'm just gonna say maybe tomorrow's gonna be my vlog day or I might get her to kind of explain how to do geocaching and uh, that kind of stuff. And I'll have this situated in a spot from Bolton here. We used to go and sit there whenever we, we kept putting bids on houses, we didn't win them. We go and sit there and we just kind of contemplate things and uh, it's a really nice spot. So that's gonna be where it's hidden. But to start it off with, I'm gonna do uh, breakfast in bed because she always loves that. Followed by a manicure because, uh, you know, if she's gonna get some pictures with her ring, I'll kind of keep you posted on that and uh, we'll get started. Okay, so here I have the little bottle here and um, I've put the description key on the end. I've also put a penny inside of it so that it sounds like the ring in there. And I'm gonna use the other half. I'm gonna put put the ring inside here because I'm not gonna leave the, the, the ring outside all night obviously. Uh, So when she's doing the decryption, I'm going to do a switcheroo and she'll not realize it. Okay, so I'm on location here. Uh, Unfortunately, there are about four guys like teenagers that are throwing rocks down the exact spot that I wanted to hide this uh, thing. So I either have to wait them out or I'm going to have to uh, find a new spot somewhere near that's still not overly visible because this thing is purple. So it's going to stick out because there's not a lot of foliage. So. That's our spot. I'll try to find a spot to hide it. Okay, success. I planted it in a stump right over there and uh, we'll see her reaction tomorrow. It should be pretty evident, uh, especially if I put that little note in the geocaching site that I'm gonna create and uh, she'll hopefully be able to find it pretty easily. And it seems like a pretty secluded spot aside from the fact that probably kids go there all the time. But with any luck, we'll have a few minutes there and everything will be perfecto. So my goal for tomorrow is to try to make her think that we're making this YouTube video. So she's gonna be hopefully commenting to you guys. Uh, so if she's talking to you as if she's in the know about what's going on, she isn't, okay? She's just totally gonna be trying to be fun and um, you know, for the video, for the, for the cameras, if she's doing it for the mass YouTube subscribers. So hopefully it'll work out. Making breakfast here, and this will be um, the last time I talk to just the camera. Now I'm going to put on a show and pretend we're making a vlog. Something warm and delicious to start off your special day. 
Hmm, perhaps it's something that you already know since you looked at the grocery bill. Loving fruit filled first thing in the morning. Yep. So why am I making you breakfast in bed? Because you love me. <laughs> <laughs> but is there anything special about today? Why are we... Nope. Should I do something nice for me? We're now in the car and uh, Anne is reading her next clue. Number two. This next stop could come in handy, quote unquote handy. Hmm, don't guess what it is. We will, uh, mm. we're on route, we'll be there shortly. Handy. Either physical hands or like handyman hands. Hmm. hmm. She'll never know. I'll never know until we get there. You want to some airbrush designs? <laughs> Mm. Okay. My beautiful nails. Clue numero trois. Hmm. Clue number three. Time for a little treasure hunting. Any guesses? Um, I would assume geocaching. Okay. We didn't have <laughs> our printer was not working, but I found. Wow. So you'll have to explain to the viewers who do not know what geocaching is. Geocaching is a worldwide kind of treasure hunting game. People have hidden little things all over the place and then you find them with the um, coordinates. Mm -hmm. Or with just hints and directions. I thought this one was perfect because I think we already know where it is. By the little water that we I think so, yeah. To. That's why I thought this one was perfect. Yeah. We're en route looking for the geocache. Under a spooky bridge. Oh, you can look at the camera because it's not like we're doing vlogs. <laughs> That's true. Okay, so this is your day of fun. Why would I pick geocaching for you, do you think? Because I enjoy geocaching, but you hate it. It's so true. So something that I enjoy and you'll, you're willing to put up with for today. That's true. It's yeah. very nice. It's not that I hate it, it's just I find it kind of, you know, you yeah, go Yeah, I just and... don't particularly enjoy it. Yeah. But I enjoy it. I enjoy the hunt for the prize and then potentially finding a prize and logging in afterwards and seeing where I found it. It's true. It's All right, here we go. Okay. Wow, the, it's looking pretty rough today. It says to the left of the stairs. At the bottom of the steps or the top of the steps? You know? I'm wondering if it's something by this rock here. Small tube. See, I just got my nails done, so I don't really want to be digging down and ruining my beautiful nails. So I'm hoping I can just see it with my eyes. Difficulty 1.5, which is not bad. I'm gonna look at this gnarled tree. Okay, small, medium. Yeah, small tube, probably like a film case. Did you find it? Yeah! I think so, unless it's just someone's garbage they left there. <laughs> oh wow! That is quite open. Okay, hold on. Okay. Let, me, let me film it here, hold on. Okay. Okay. Yeah! Sometimes you just don't know if maybe it's someone's garbage, but this I think is actually what it's supposed to be. So just open it? Yeah. Is that a no? Yeah. Here, I'll hold the tube. Or you want to hold the bag? So I get the tube or the note off. I'll just put the bag here. I'll take the tube. Let me get a better angle. Now it wants me to decipher. It says, please decipher on a different piece of paper. Oh. 613-12. Do you have... Bye. Wait, hold on. Let's write it down so it's fun for the viewers. Okay. Okay. Do you have a pen? Yeah. Okay. Okay, maybe write it, if you can, write it big so that we can see it in the camera. I'll go over your shoulder. It's a lot. A lot to be writing. So 6, 13, 12, Y. So, so far it spells U, 11, 7, 8. Hold on, pause there. Let me, let me put this, prop this somewhere. Okay, here we go. Okay. You are my... Three eight I 
I guess we can assume what we know that says. Friend. And... You were my best friend. You were my best friend, you. <laughs> Is this from you? For me? You are my heart? Doesn't seem right. You are my best friend. You are my heart. You planted this year? That's not possible. Eight, nine, eight, seven. It's still working, yeah. <laughs> Too big because it uh, has to be fit, but. Crazy guy. Wow, that was handy <laughs> that you had your manicure done. Yeah. Girl. Okay. Worked out. She didn't seem to know anything. And good thing no one still stumbled upon it. Imagine someone found it. That's true. Imagine that. Oh. I thought this was your style. Yes. It was very, very good. You sneaky guy. Okay, let's take a few pictures since you're here. Okay, so Anne's just going to call her mum, who has not heard of any of the news yet, and uh, we'll see what her reaction is. Hello, how's it going? How are you? Good, guess what? What? Uh, Andrew and I went geocaching, and inside the ring, or inside the container, I found a ring, and Andrew proposed to me. Sneaky. <laughs> Thanks, thanks. 